Yo, what up? Apparently this is a video on how to use Fast Copy version 2.11, which I guess is by H. Shirouzu. All right, so what you got to what you really got to know about this, this isn't super obvious, but you can use this listing button to uh, list what it's going to do. And then if you actually if you remove or give it a, a slash or a back a backslash at the end of the uh, destination directory this like changes the behavior so what you actually want to do in this case what I want to do is this I think because I'm trying to I'm trying to put these see not because I've chosen difference and no overwrite so I had these other files like zoom 033 like this stuff's actually there on the uh, on the m colon folder 01 directory path but uh, I've because I can list this and I know it's on difference and no override, this is only gonna move this stuff. And what I like about fast copy is that it doesn't destroy the date modified uh, accessed and created metadata. So that's why I use it. So let's go ahead and do our file transfer. And you know what? Why don't I just keep this rolling so we can see how, how slow or how fast my uh my zoom interface and my hard disk are. Uh, in terms of the write speed, so it looks like the rate is going at about five megabytes per second, or slightly slower, which is pretty fast, I think. So this is this is going pretty well. So I'll just let that roll. back in like 30 seconds for some some more uh
playing the guitar. If you can even hear me. <laughs>
Yeah, I know, the food's ready, thanks. Okay. Okay. Okay.